John Kitzel. Let's hear from John Kitzel. I'm the old white guy. I didn't have to do a knuckle bump. Uh, very nice, too. Yeah, you know, I just mentioned that I, I'm watching the comments come in tonight, and I see you know different people have the uh, some guys do a chest bump, the knuckle bump, and at uh, 12 and Locust they do the cock smooch. Like stop doing that. <laughs> this is not a mullet. Okay, I am. Uh, <laughs> I know when I walk down, you're like, oh, here's a roofer to give an estimate. Uh, please, uh, uh, He's a roadie for the Dropkick Murphys. I know, I can't help you. you know, I, I, I went to a bachelor party at a strip joint, and the, the guy's like, Jazzle, your father's here. Thank you very much. Great. Uh, two things that I hate. Two things that I hate. One, uh, catching the cable guy go with my wife's bras and panties. <laughs> And the second thing I hate is pretending I have a wife. I'm 26. I don't count those years as in glow. Okay. Um, oh, but you know, it's weird, you know, being my of a certain age is weird. It's like uh, uh, my my dates today. All right. Uh, you know, I usually say the same three things. Uh, you know, you go online and girls like, how do I recognize your car? Like uh, it has a Domino's sign on the roof. <laughs> Then uh, when a date starts, uh, <laughs> I say, uh, hey, do you know if there's a coin star around this Apple Beach? <laughs> <laughs> uh, and uh, the last thing, my dates, women usually want me saying the same thing. Uh, hey, where are you going? I paid for a full hour. <laughs> okay, sorry. <laughs> sorry. I, uh, now, this is very, very nice for tonight, too. And if you're single people every night, too, this works on all genders or whatever you want to do. This is how you pick up. All right. Uh, I live in like Northeast Philadelphia. And there's a, a, a nightclub there called Michaels. Okay. You, you, one person knows it. Okay. <laughs> Mill. Right. Oh, like, no. It's an older singles crowd. It's an old. It, there are old people in there. It's older. It's like the Regal Beagle from Freeze Company. <laughs> they are old, right? Uh, you go in there. Like if, I'm serious. If I ask a woman, hey, what's your sign? Is usually do not resuscitate. <laughs> phone number has like five numbers in it, right? <laughs> uh, but uh, uh, I'll tell you what, you know, I love, I love the older women too, because you know, I'm into the prune tang. <laughs> <laughs> that was my kind of joke, thank you very much. I'll be selling t-shirts after the show tonight too. Uh, how, oh, uh, segways, <laughs> Halloween's coming up. <laughs> All right. Every year my mom's like, hey John, you're the weirdo uncle. Take your niece and nephews on a haunted hayride. They can use some like Shady Brook Farms or Jason's Woods or something scary for kids. Like a taping of the view. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I, people, I'm from a big Irish Catholic family. I'm one of seven kids. I have 25 nieces and nephews. I can't afford to take them on a hayride. On a hayride. <laughs> so you know what I did? I just drove them through Camden. My window's down. <laughs> My name is John Kensel. Thank you very much for coming out.